Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark. Uh, so I'm just now leaving the uh, the Hunter's Lodge, uh, where we found uh, the, the broken Hunter's Spear, uh, so that we can kill this old bear and whatnot. Uh, I have a couple pieces of uh, news, some bad news, um, some relatively, I guess, even, even keel neutral news, I guess? Um, so first bit of news, and, uh, I'll, I'll go with the neutral first. Uh, this is a, I guess, a little bit of a minor spoiler, so if you guys are playing through, uh, The Long Dark, uh, maybe, like, cover your ears or something like that. Um, so, as you guys recall, while we were in the hunting lodge, uh, we heard the phone ring, uh, while we were headed into the basement. Um, from what I was reading, I looked it up on the interwebs. Uh, from what I was reading on the interwebs, uh, that phone rings, uh, but apparently it's never meant to be picked up. Uh, and all I've learned is that at some point in the future, we will learn what the deal is, uh, with all of that jazz. Um, alright, and moving on to the, uh, the, the bit of bad news that I have. I've been doing a little bit of reading, uh, on the- oh man, why is there just a snowstorm happening right now? <laughs> What's going on? Other than the fact that I'm in, uh, in, in northern Canada, I guess. Um, yeah, the other bit of, uh, the other bit of news, I like how I'm just, like, on these rocks talking to you guys. Um, the other bit of bad news that I have, uh, is that apparently, um, coal is very scarce in this game. Uh, and we need to use the forge in order to fix the broken, uh, spear so that we can kill this old bear. Oh my god. It is getting rough out here. What the heck? Save me, rocks. <laughs> Save me from the cold. Um, right, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Um, so we need to uh, use the forge to repair the broken hunting spear. Um, and apparently, the only... Um, the only way that you can get the forge hot enough... I'm freaking you know, going inside, man, for a little bit. Screw this. Screw you and your snow. Uh, let's run inside real quick. Because otherwise I'm just going to freeze to death while I'm telling my story. Um, the only way that you can heat the forge uh, enough to actually use it is by using coal. So apparently you can't just use like regular wood or anything like that in order to heat the forge. Uh, that is a problem. Because a couple episodes ago, you guys uh, may recall... That I actually wasted all of that coal that you find in the maintenance shed. Um, yeah. And that stuff does not respawn. Uh, that does not respawn at all. Um, so that kind of creates a, uh, a little bit of a dilemma. Um, I've been trying to do a lot of research, in all honesty. Uh, trying to figure out, like, coal locations on the map so I don't really waste a whole lot of time. Um, but I think essentially what it's going to come down to is I'm just going to have to go on a little bit of an adventure for coal. Uh, and that might mean doing it in between episodes. It might mean, um, doing it, uh, uh during an episode. I don't really know yet. I don't really have any sort of game plan. I'm just kind of winging it at this point. Um, yeah. So I think, uh, I think that there was coal like, by the wrecked train cars in the Forlorn, uh, Muskeg or whatever, uh, that's a pretty good hike back, I believe. Um, but that might be a good location for us to kind of go check, go check for some, some Feels extra coal. Like a lot of gear. I know, man. Can you just stop complaining? <laughs> Seriously. I just can't, I can't do anything about it. Um, we also, actually, you know what? Before I actually really do anything, let's um, let's take a little peeksy over this. Hey, I do have a lot of gear on me. I tried in between episodes. I really tried to to narrow it down, and I just didn't really work out. Uh, you also find coal in in cave locations. Uh, those are a little hard to spot, I think, at least. Um. I have a feeling that there might be something like...
From where? Oh, hello. <laughs> I might get bit again here. There's another one coming up not too far after him. Let's get the frick out of here if we can. Let's just go check out this, like, rocky outcove here. Yeah, I killed your friend. You really want to mess with me? Oh, he's, like, taking off. Maybe there's a cave up there. Maybe he's trying to show me the coal. He's like, please, sir, don't shoot me. There's coal up that way. And there very well might be. That looks like kind of a, uh, a place where you, you would find some coal. <laughs> What's this wolf doing? He's going nuts. It's kind of funny, the, uh, the animal uh, animations in this game. Um, let's head this way and see what we got. I am running real low on water. I did not bother while I was in the hunting lodge to, uh, to get any more water. Okay, there's no... I don't see any caves up there. Let's try up this way. Why not? Yeah, so... That's just kind of a, um, that's just kind of where I'm at. That is my dilemma. Okay, dude, I just killed your friend. Do you really want to play this game? Do you really want to play this? Oh, 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 oh! I got him in the, I shot him in the leg! I shot him in the leg. I keep forgetting to pick up my rifle cartridges. That's okay, I think. We'll leave it. We'll leave the. We'll leave the cartridge there because I gotta. I gotta book it. Uh, let's just get, take a little stroll up this way. I think the wolf showed me the way. Maybe he. Sh maybe that wolf showed me to a cave entrance, like a hidden one up here. Very doubtful. I don't think this is a hidden cave entrance. I do not think that this is a hidden cave entrance. I can't really... Okay, so anyway, I had an extra mountaineering rope, so I'm just going to use that... Oh, look at that bridge. Uh, I'm just going to use the mountaineering rope to get down here, and I think that I'm not going to be able to use it because I'm too over-encumbered. Uh, yikes. I've dropped so much stuff, though. I have really tried to make a uh, an effort... To drop a lot of stuff. Can I just drop that? <laughs> I didn't think that would work. Um, can I drop that? How much? Why can't I? I hate. I hate this inventory management stuff. There we go. Okay, so I'm below 45. I'm still too encumbered, but I think 45... Uh, is this real? Alright, I'm not gonna waste a whole lot of time. I'm gonna leave those shells there, because I do want the ability to sprint, just so I don't screw around anymore. I'm trying to think... It'd be kind of cool. It'd be really cool, actually. I don't want to pick those up, even though I do need the tea. It would be really cool, actually, if, like, you could use, like, lantern fuel or something like that to really stoke the fire or the forge and just use regular logs. Uh, but I don't, I don't really think that that's going to be the case. Um, yeah. Not great. I see some... I see something up here. Uh, I did really, you guys aren't going to believe me, but I did really try to um, clear up some inventory space. I just couldn't do it. Oh, there's some mushrooms there too. I need those for the side quest as well. What are you? What are you? Are you just a, are you just a weird texture? I see. I see. I need these. I need to make some tea. I'm not going to be able to carry this load oh, for much you longer. you shush your face. How do you guys, let me know in the comments below, um, if you guys, how you guys, like, manage your inventory. I feel like there's just so much stuff that you need to maintain. 
And I feel like, also, if I was doing a single-player playthrough of this without recording, I'd probably just set up safe houses in the areas that I go to, like, and just, like, drop all my gear or whatever. But doing that, it's kind of like... Oh, what if I what if I were to run into something that I needed a specific tool in order to uh, like break down or you know fix or something like that? Like, what if I left my hacksaw behind and I needed to break down some metal to do stuff? You know. So it's just um, that's one of the things that I I do not like about this game. It's just the inventory management. It makes sense. I under Don't get me wrong. I understand it. It's just so frustrating. Um, I'm just... I gotta check. I gotta check around the map. Um, it might be a, a boring couple of episodes. Uh, there are definitely episodes like that in this playthrough. What the heck? This is like... This is an area where a bear would hang out if I was a bear, I'd think. All these, uh trees and stuff blowing over. I do see a cave. Okay, we gotta go. I don't know what's over there. It may be death. It may be coal. If it's coal... If it's coal, great. If it's death, not so great. Oh, look at this place. This place is nuts. Golden. Okay, that wolf is running away for some reason. Why is he running away? That was... That was very... Wolf? hell are you doing? Oh, there's like blood and stuff in here. Okay, well, listen. Let's just... Blood. Is that the wolf that I shot? That's not the wolf that I shot earlier. <laughs> it's like a, it's a wounded wolf. A wounded wolf on Wall Street. Um, I'm just, unfortunately... Fortunately, it looks like I'm striking out on some coal in here and that's not great. I don't think I need that much coal. But I mean, I definitely do need coal. <laughs> Alright, well that's kind of a bummer. Wolf! Did you eat all the coal? Is it you? I'll finish the job. You wanted to mess around? You wanted to mess around, Wolf? I don't play those games. You know I don't play those games. Wonder what's up there. I don't know. Do you think that's another... I, I wouldn't imagine that there'd be another cave up that way. Alright, let's just... Let's keep on keeping on. Yeah, I just don't know, guys. Um... Oh, I'm running out of water. I'm running out of all things. So that's my last bit of water. I need... I just need to get... And the sun's about to go down, too. I need to get... I don't really know what to do. I really don't know what to do. There is the potential right now that I, I die out here. 
Absolutely. It's very, it's very possible that I die right now. Um, is there anything else that I can just drop? Uh, drop. Let's go. I just need my sprint back. Man, uh, this inventory, this stupid, all this stuff that I got, it sucks. Everything sucks. I'm just killing wolves left and right. I can't even use their stuff. Okay, so this is the way that I want to go. Little detour, that's fine. Um... I need to make it to the maintenance shed, at least make it to the maintenance shed, and since I'm gonna come back to the maintenance shed, I'm gonna have to just drop off a bunch of stuff, and then probably just go on a hunt for coal. I think that's, I think that's where I'm at. That's the point that I'm at right now. I don't even really know why I'm all that worried about it. I was just that big of an idiot to use all that coal. Man, oh, ah. it's also kind of frustrating, too, because the way that the game is designed, like, you're going to go, you're, you're going to go to the maintenance shed before you go to the hunting lodge, when in actuality, it should be in reverse. The game should push you towards the hunting lodge and then to the maintenance shed so that if they're just going to give you a freebie with coal... Or, uh, uh, anything over there? If they're gonna give you, like, a coal freebie or whatever, then at least, then at least it's your fault if you went out and actually sought out the, uh, the maintenance shed before you did the, uh, the main storyline, right? Right. When you've done something stupid, blame the game. Not the mistakes that you made. Um, I wonder if it would behoove me. Oh, there is a, uh, okay, there's a hunting lodge here. Let's, uh, I forgot about the ice. I forgot about the ice, guys. Get off the ice. Get off the freaking ice. Please don't crack. I forgot that the ice cracks. How could I ever forget after my encounter with the, the freezing water? Cave. Cool. Okay, so there are definitely some caves around here. This is the worst hunter's blind ever. There are definitely some caves around here that we can uh, leverage and explore for some coal. We are not that far away from the maintenance shed. If I can just find some stupid coal, it'd be great. Some old man's beard. Hello? Hello, coal. Dude, why is there just frickin' firewood in here? Why is there not coal? Oh, come on, man. Like a pickaxe. Frickin' Minecraft style. Get some, get me some darn coal. That's it. That's, that's not good. Two caves striking out on the coal. Come on, caves. What's going on here? Is this not, is this not, can I not burn that? <laughs> is that not burnable? I don't need these rocks, man. I need some coal. Do you hear me? Do you hear me, coal gods? Um. That doesn't weigh too much. Maybe I can grab some of this. Yeah, it's not going to over-encumber me because it only weighs 
uh, kilogram. So we need that for our, that side quest. And then we have the uh, the Rishi, Rishi mushrooms as well. So maybe I can finally get that quest done and then I don't have to carry some of this stuff. Thank you. Now, in the event that I do have to go back to the forlorn uh, muskeg, I'm gonna, I'll probably do so off camera, and then I'll just make like a, make a speed run. I'll probably just drop all my gear at the maintenance shed, then just run back with my gun to the, um, those train cars or whatever. All right, let's get back there. Oh man, no, I want to go across the ice. I do not. Yeah, so I'll probably just drop all my gear in the the maintenance shed, I'll run all the ba oh, way back to those train cars where I think there's some coal. Now, if there's no coal there, I'm in uh, I'm a, I'm in a different world of hurt at that point because I don't really I would have to do a whole lot of like off-camera exploring in order to find that stuff that might not work out too well any caves cave looking things any houses would be equally as awesome don't fall in, don't fall in, don't fall in the ice. Let's just kind of take a little detour here, get some high ground. I want to take a look at what's out over that way. If I can, if I spot a cave or whatever, that'd be so clutch. I can't believe this spear is broken. This guy bought this spear for... I'd assume a pretty crazy amount of money. He's just gonna let it sit there and waste. Okay, I don't got I don't have anything. I don't see anything. Alright. It's just it's the way that it's gonna be, I guess. I I don't think that we can get the forge up to whatever. Whatever temperature it needs to be. I just don't think it's possible. Well, also, let's take a lap around the uh, the yard here before we go in. Check some of these... Um, I guess check some of these red crates or whatever. I also would hate to only find like one piece of coal and not, and that not be enough to heat the uh, the forge. Because then what the heck do I do then? There's a lot of pallets, a lot of pallets. So there's definitely a good good stock of wood around here. Can I burn the truck? Some gasoline, maybe? All of I could have avoided all of this if I just... How would I have known? How would I have known not to burn that coal? Don't you yawn at me. Is there any, like, leftover coal in here? I don't think so. Ah, <sighs> sigh. Anything over here? No, maintenance cars. Anything? You guys got a forge inside. Wait a minute, wait a minute. All this gear is slowing me down. Wait a minute. How can I look in you? How can I see in you? If I can't see in it, I can't get into it. Okay, we, we have some hope here. There is some hope. Not a lot of hope, for sure. Some hope, though. 
Let's grab some, uh, let's grab some wood. What I'm gonna do here, and I know it's a little bit cheaty. It's dusk, so night can't be far behind. Yeah, I know what dusk is. Why does it take me so long to get all these pallets? All right. Oh man, super slow motion. That took a long time for me to break down a few, a few simple pallets. Okay, so while I'm walking slowly towards the forge, um, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna be a little cheaty and I'm gonna save the game. <laughs> I'm gonna save the game right before I use the forge. Cause if two coal isn't enough and I gotta go out and venture out and find some more coal, then I don't want to have wasted two coal. Um, I've already been kind of an idiot. Uh, I don't wanna continue being an idiot. <laughs> and I need to stop saying that cause is it really my fault that, that I, I used up all the coal in here? Is it really? Come on now. Let's be honest with ourselves. All right, wolves, can you just stop? What is this thing? Can I pick this up? No, but I'll take the fire log. All right, get me inside at least. I am thirsty too. So thirsty. Okay, so let us get the frick off of here because we're standing exactly where a live wire was, aren't we? Oh, come on, man. What are we what are we doing here? I'm also running out of food, but I didn't want to harvest I didn't want to harvest any um wolf meat or anything like that, because it would be torture if I had to walk this slow the entire way. Bottles. What do we got? Oh, this is all my junk that I... <laughs> lantern fuel, lantern fuel. Alright, so I gotta pick up some of this, because I need to uh, get a fire going. This is some of the junk that I dropped uh, before I started recording uh, last episode. I'll pick up that stuff. Oh, this is painful. So painful. Uh, let's just find a... Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna creep towards this thing, and hopefully I get a prompt to, like, open it up. I need to find something to drink. Okay, okay. Aha! Okay, so we can open this. And now, let us sort by heavy. Oh man, I got 50 reclaimed woods. Okay, drop that off. Um, drop off. Oh, I probably need that hammer, don't I, if this is going to work. Uh, keep the lantern. Um, drop the hacksaw. Drop the flashlight. Keep the pot. Pry bar. Gone. Uh, quality tools. Guess keep that. Knife, cloth, uh, leather, um, distress pistol, we'll get rid of all that. Um, what else do I got? Okay, so I think, um, I don't know why I'm being selective here. I just need to ditch everything, really. Oh, that can't fit anything? What else do we got here? Uh, uh, what else aren't we gonna need? Well, whatever. At least I can walk a little faster now towards the forge so I can dump off some of this wood and whatnot. 
also a ton of wood in here, so I don't know why I felt the need to get wood outside. All right, forge. Let's see what you got. Uh, we'll go ahead and uh, we'll just uh, we'll just go ahead. You guys can see that I uh, <laughs> I've used up a lot of saves. Uh, so we'll go to ten. Confirm. And I gotta overwrite it. Uh, what is this one? This is like, I think this is thirty. Save thirty, maybe. Apparently, you can over. You can only have like twenty saves or whatever. All right. Uh, well, let's try it, shall we? So we got a fire log. Should have used some accelerant. So, we need to get the forge up to 150? Or 160? I'm not 100% sure on that. Let's do this. Holy crap! Oh, guys, I am... What the heck, man? <laughs> oh, my gosh. You have got to be kidding me. Can I not cook frickin' water? Or boil water on the forge? Is it too hot? Why can't I do this? I do need- I definitely need, do need some water. Okay, guys, um, so apparently the forge just lights itself to 170 degrees Celsius without the coal. So everything that I just did, completely wasted. And I could cut it out. But I'm not going to because I want to see. I want you guys to see the struggle because the struggle was definitely real. Um, the struggle was definitely real. Also, the the forge is like infinite, uh, by the way. Um, so let's uh, <laughs> let's just waste everything by trying to clear up some inventory space. Uh, prepared rishis. If I don't rest soon, I'm gonna faint. You're fine. Shut up. Um, spearhead. Does this work? Okay, so we got two out of two scrap metal, so I'm glad I actually read that on the internet, inner, interwebs. I got the heavy hammer. 1.2 hours. Um, begin crafting. Problem is, I, I really need some water. Guess I can add blacksmith to my growing list of skills. Wow! <laughs> That's fancy. Let's hope I don't have to put this spear to the test. Okay, uh, well, anyway, guys, what a, what a shit show, what a real shit show, for lack of a better term. I am, uh, I am really salty that I went on quest to find coal when I could have just come straight here, and the forge just lights itself, uh, as part of the story mission. That is just really, uh, really cruel that the game would do something like that. Uh, so, anyway, guys, um... I think that's where I'm gonna leave things off. We have the we have the spearhead. Um, I'm gonna stick around here for a little bit because A, I need water. B, I need to sleep. C, uh, I need to do a little bit of inventory management. Uh, D, uh, probably a bunch of other stuff as well. Uh, but anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed my uh, pain and suffering as I as I tried to find some coal that was not even needed. Not even needed. <laughs> what a real tragedy that is. Uh, but anyway, guys, I'm gonna chill out here, uh, make some, uh, get some uh, water going, all that good stuff. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you did enjoy, please definitely drop a like and a comment below. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you are not subscribed already, I do put out, uh, get, bleh, I do put out daily gaming videos, so uh, be sure to do that so you don't miss anything. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.